When Breath Becomes Air is a memoir written by Paul Kalanithi, a neurosurgeon who was diagnosed with terminal cancer in his mid-30s. It is a heartbreaking story about a man who was passionate about neuroscience, literature, meaning, and his family. He wanted to make sure he left his wisdom in writing to help others understand the importance of life and how to live it to the fullest. We will explore the life and philosophy of Paul Kalanithi and discover the three most interesting things we can learn from his story. Lesson 1, Neuroscience and Writing were Kalanithi's two passions. Growing up, Paul Kalanithi fell in love with literature. But on his way to Stanford, he got a book that explored the idea that the brain is a machine that allows the human mind to exist. His fascination led to him taking neuroscience courses. He drew from works that connected meaninglessness and isolation, concluding that true meaning comes from human relationships. He felt that if he wanted to understand life, he needed to understand the most unavoidable part of it all, death. And what better way to do this than practice medicine? Lesson 2, he learned much about life and death during his time in medical school and later as a doctor. During his time in medical school, Kalanithi spent a lot of time with cadavers. He was moved by their humanity. His first experience with a birth was also about death, and this experience left him with the image of life one day and death the next. When he specialized in neurosurgery, he realized how much responsibility he would have in life or death decisions. He also witnessed many deaths, both from patients and people who worked at the hospital. Lesson 3, Kalani T's life ended in his mid-30s from cancer, but his reflections on the illness can teach us much about life. By the time his residency was ending, he had earned awards and the respect of senior doctors. But then he found out he had malignant lung cancer that was spreading across his body. He contemplated what to do with the time he had left, and his doctor advised him to do what really mattered. He and his wife decided to have the child they always wanted. In the last month of his life, he focused on being with family and living his life to the fullest. He left us with a message to live each day as if it was our last. When breath becomes ill, both inspiring and tragic at the same time. It was fascinating to hear about death from the perspective of both a doctor and a patient. This book will help you understand what is truly important in life and helps you confront the inevitability of death. We are thankful to Dr. Kalanithi for sharing such beautiful thoughts about what gives life meaning. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel.